three. Wow! I can hear the pressure, the, the drum pressure over there. Oh. oh my god, it is working now. The water is coming smoothly. Good morning, everyone. Okay, today uh, I just visited the corn farm and I found that this is really need water and they use everyday uh, pump machine. But I just have an idea to make a drum pump for them. You can see that the right here is become yellow already because no water. They cannot support the water, supply the water from the deep river. So today I just make a drum pump from the deep river for them. But I'm not sure that I can make or not because the level is a little bit low. So let me do it for you right away. can make the drum come from this river. <laughs> uh, yeah. Alright. You have it. I will put tie here and anchor through this way to the corn. Okay, then I will install the intake water pipe by this way and direction to the water over there. So I do it right away. Okay, so now I'm starting to install the intake water pipe. Okay, some so I need to use the glue. That air proof is not leaking here. Alright, so this one will reconnect up there. And my cow is crying because I'm very angry. Okay, so now. Right, my cows. So now I start to store here. the wild checks the food wild here it's not allowed to have okay my phone is ringing okay so I'm starting to using the glue to stick the food wild it's going to drop into the water into the river make sure the water never return back from the drum hey then I will make it to the river. Oh. Alright. Now the water is coming. Ooh, great. Okay, so the water is here. When the drum rises, the water just drops down into the drum. It's easy to understand, so just keep it to the water. And I'm starting to Connect the angle wire here. All right. Okay. 
make sure the glue is not hard yet. We just put together and then we can uh, readjust whatever we want. Like this. Like this. And then like this. Alright, firm. Now the intake water pipe is finished. I'm starting to install output water pipe. Okay. So this is to install the first water into the drum. You have to put it by this way or that way. Yeah, pressure. Okay. Great. Okay, so the cap is need to be closed properly to make sure that the air is not leaking here. If the air leaking here is very, very dangerous, it never works. So I apply the glue carefully and I have it firmly. Okay, and just connect the pipe until to the to the farm. Hopefully this one is the last basket. Woo! Beautiful! Okay, so actually we just make 40% or 80% or 100% depending on us, but I actually just installed it until full. It's time for me. It will be work 100%. Alright, so. What I'm gonna do is just open the output part. I put valve, so this is the master valve. So now I open it, so the water just going, and the drum is start pressing right now. I can hear some water dropping from from the river, but I didn't open the last valve yet. So I'm going to open the last valve. it will be work okay so I start to open right away one two and three wow! 
Ow! I can't hear the pressure, the, the drum pressure over there. Oh. oh my god, it is working now. The water is coming smoothly. It's not too strong, it's not too low, but it, it, it is like uh, the water gravity is like a very heavy from succession, suction air from the intake water pipe. So it won't just go away strongly because it's a little bit slowly and heavy from the suction to replace the air in the drum. heavy water like this it means that the gravity is try to replace the air in the drum slowly so this is depending on the intake water pipe if the, the intake water pipe water coming fast the water here also fast but the intake slow heavy because the level is too deep it will just slow like this so this is what the drum pump works it's not like the sea foam because the water level is different about two or three meter from the intake water, so it's not it's not uh, lower than intake water. So it's working now. As you can see, the turbine is coming without pushing too strong. So just keep it work like this about 24 hours. So the rice here and the corn farm will have enough water here. So I'm going to listen at the drum if I can hear the water dropping. So it it works. Ah, now we can hear the water dropping. Yes, work. Can hear. Just listen here. You hear the water dropping? Yes. Work. Almost deformed right now, but it's not deformed because this drum is a little bit hot and the water level and the intake water is small, so it's not pressed until deformed. But if you put this one is bigger than this and the lower water level, it will deform this drum. That's our experience. So this is just a simple method and a simple installation that we used to do before, and here is right similar so it's working I just keep it 24 hour and let's see the farm and the right field how much water get with 24 hour working with juicing this drum pump. so everyone thank you for watching my tutorial today and I hope you enjoy with this tutorial and sharing or 